Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's Caramel Quails here again with another video. So my hair has not fully recovered at all, like at all, like not even close to being recovered. Um, you can see for yourself. I mean, I just put a leave-in in my hair to style it into the slick back bun or pony, but you guys can see that the bounce back still isn't there, the elasticity, elasticity still isn't there. My hair still feels really, really dry. But as before this happened, a few of you guys had asked me how I style my head wraps because you saw my picture that I posted on Instagram as well as on my community post. So as this tutorial doesn't really require me to, you know, do too much manipulating to my hair, my hair is already styled into a slick back um, ponytail. So I typically like to do this style whenever I've already done a slick back ponytail and it's getting a little crusty. So you guys can see that my hair is just... It looks a little crunchy, it's a little frizzy. You can see like gaps in some places. I like, whenever I'm doing a slick back style, I like how it looks the first day. Sometimes I like how it looks the second day, but for the most part, you know, um, yeah, it just starts to look a little crusty and I'm not a huge fan of that look. But if you have somewhere to be and you don't feel like, you know, wetting your hair all over again and applying more gel and manipulating your hair even more, you can just style your hair with a head wrap, which really just requires you to lay your edges. So, Let's jump right into it. So I already have an edge tutorial on my channel, but I can, I guess, run you guys through this. So I have my toothbrush and my rat tail comb. These are one of the most important things. I have my water bottle with, my spray bottle with warm water. I also have my Camille Rose Coconut Water Hydrating Elixir just so I can like apply a little moisture to my edges. And lastly, my Eco Styler Gel. Can't forget this. This is, this is actually one of the most important components. All right, so now that my edges are laid, I'm gonna go ahead and set them right quick just because, you know, we want our edges to last. We didn't put in all that work for no reason. All right, so I think my edges have had plenty of time to set. Oh yeah. They're ready. Now let's get into tying the head wrap. So I have this scarf that I got from Target. It is the shape of like a rectangle, but I just fold it in half so I can get a square. It's kind of hard for you guys to see the whole thing, but. Now that I have it shaped into a square, I'm gonna go ahead and fold over one of the corners slightly so that it's the shape of like a triangle. So you have four corners and one of the corners is folded over. So here's the here's one corner, here's the other corner, and then this is the this is the last corner here. But one of the corners, I think you guys get it. One of the corners I'm folding over. And that same corner that I folded over, I'm just gonna flip back. And you want it to be right at your hairline so that you can see the edges, but you're not gonna see the hair because we haven't laid the like most of your hair, you pretty much just only laid your edges. So let's bring that up. So yeah, and a few of you guys had questions on how I tie it so that it stays secure and it doesn't slide off my head. So what you're gonna do is you're connect you're gonna connect these two parts here at the back, but you're gonna have a nice tight grip. Nice tight grip. So it's like right here. And you're gonna twist it. So this piece right here, you're gonna twist from under, keep twisting, keep twisting until it starts to, until the entire head wrap starts to twist. Nice and tight, keep twisting, keep twisting, keep twisting. And then you go ahead and just wrap that around the bun or the back of the pony. Tie it around and then tuck it under here and that's pretty much it y'all it's literally it 
I hope that made sense. And I usually like to add a curl here. This one's a little small. Well, they're both kind of small, but you guys saw in the picture. I like to take out a nice coil so that it hangs and, you know, it just gives us a personality. So that pretty much concludes this video y'all. Got my chunk guys in, edges are laid, head wrap is secured. I know you guys, a lot of you guys were concerned about, you know, this sliding off, but I've never had any issues with it. Well, I have in the past until I discovered that you have to really tighten it at the back here. That's gonna really, that's really what's gonna keep it secure. Um, unless I like, oh wow, why would I do that? <laughs> but even still, it's secure. So if you guys found this video helpful, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Don't know if I'm going to see you guys next week. It really just depends on if my hair gets it together. But all being well, I will see you guys next week.